Lucy blames the weather. Hi, I'm Debbie. Government announced reggae concert cancelled amid mounting fears of the Delta variant and the stalling of COVID vaccinations. Also this week, Budget Toots and Freddie hard acts to follow. But the revitalized festival song contest back with a few well-known names. Freedom is coming tomorrow. Babs arranged a meeting with members of her ministry's new task force Tuesday. This after the PM spoke in Parliament last week on lifting restrictions hobbling the entertainment sector. I feel the pain and the Prime Minister feel the pain. But government already having to backtrack on a limited attendance concert slated to usher in COVID relaxations. The event cancelled and replaced with the showing of a Dennis Brown documentary. Minister Grange blaming the weather. We always check the weather when we plan an event. And it is indicated that uh, forecast that we will have scattered thunderstorm. I didn't want to take the risk because remember now, we are reopening and we are resetting and we want to make sure we do it right. Also forecast, however, another wave of COVID cases due to the highly infectious Delta variant now sweeping some parts of the globe which calls into question the timing of this sector's reopening. And today I must tell you, this has not been an easy decision. And even while we have made this decision, we can put a stop. So it's going to depend on everyone being compliant. Dependent also perhaps on a faster, better organized vaccine rollout. That coming to a grinding halt last week when supplies ran out. Even many who'd been assured of their second jab were turned away at the national arena. 65,000 doses of AstraZeneca sent from Mexico Tuesday, but the U.S. slow to deliver on its vaccine promises, with hundreds of thousands of vials reportedly now at risk of being dumped. Are you personally disappointed that the Americans the carriers of the big stick have been slow to help Jamaica. Anthony, I'm Because not, a lot of people are, you know. Anthony, I'm not in a position to express my personal opinion when it comes to diplomatic matters. Enough vaccines will be coming. We expect a large shipment in August. We expect a large shipment this week. And I know the Minister of Health and the Minister of Foreign Affairs, they are doing their best to it. Has their best been enough? You saw the scenes of chaos at the National Arena where people were were advised, reminded to show up for their vaccines on Saturday, went to the National Arena and were turned away. Anthony, those are teething pains. That's, we that's will a get shambles, enough vaccines. That's we will, we will get enough vaccines, our people will be vaccinated, and we will get over this situation. So you were embarrassed, but it's a hurdle you'll get over. Anthony, once you know you have done your best, all you can do is stand proud and say, I will try to do better. Who knows, maybe they'll offer you the Ministry of Health next time around. I love my job. Grinch's job including oversight for events like a bubble party for which Dream Entertainment was quick to apply for a permit. I can't tell you I'm going to give them the go ahead. It goes to Odpem. Yes, a bubble event, fully vaccinated, fine. And also COVID tests, fine. We, one has to be able to validate those who say they have been fully vaccinated and to validate the COVID test. Once those things are in place and can be done, I don't see a difficulty. Is there any other route to fully opening Jamaica? No. So what you have to do is prepare yourself to get vaccinated. No matter where in this world I go, I am a Jamaican. The minister announcing 12 finalists for the festival song competition, which this year turns 55. Babs is trumpeting the group's diversity. I Octane, Loot and Fire and Fab Five in the mix. Stacia's one of three women competing, as well as a visually impaired contestant. Three million dollars once more in the offing, an equal split between songwriter, singer and producer. We're going on over 30 digital platforms again, we're going to the world. Dance a lot, water boy can run. Must be a Jamaican.